Again, it's your least favorite YouTuber. Don't know what that was about, but today we're going to be doing this. Okay. So, first work is my bunny and my chicken, which I forever want them to stay here. Toy Story 4 was an awesome movie. Anyway. My lamp, I don't think, goes right there. No, it doesn't. Uh, these pens back here do. I don't think I want them over here now, though. So, nope. Let's see. Aha. A lot of this stuff right here goes over there. It's so, like, Greg. Who, you're going to see. Brand new action. Over here, I have my water bottle that I use once quite a while ago now. We're going to water Greg. Perfect. nice good soil for you that's what that giant thing I was trying to dust off up here was soil but I don't think Greg is gonna go right here because that's where we're gonna put him now he pricked me right there for now but I don't think he's gonna go right here because the mic's right here will bother him and he needs to be a center of attention he won't fit under there I mean, I'm doing, like, a whole bunch of new things, maybe. We'll figure that out in a second. Because a lot of this stuff right here is not going to go over there. Like, a lot of these stuffies, I'm going to put somewhere else to show. Some of them I am still going to keep over there. I don't know what I'm going to do yet. But let's just get to the stuff I know I'm going to keep over there. So like this, and my raccoon. So, I like it. I'm all the way down here, it looks nice. Uh, this water should not still be here. It was for Greg and Greg's all the way. I don't know if I want to put him here because I can step on him and hurt him or her myself. So I'm going to put Greg right here for right now. Okay. Okay. Hmm. I guess I'll put this up. Because I know this is going to stay. And go right back where it was. Because that just looks aesthetically, aesthetically pleasing to me. I said it. I should earn an award for saying that. This lamp went all the way up here, but I'm kind of right here now like this but not like that there. or what I think is actually the aesthetical option there. sorry but right there you see how the light is? Really nice. For now, we're going to leave that on. And just move its cord all the way back. Through the stuffies. Through, well, not through, but behind the stuffies. Behind the desk, behind the bake shelf thing. 
nice. And then I can put my phone right here. Do video intros. My laptop. Yeah. Oh, we ain't doing that right now. He's going to go right here. Get the water. And again, like everything else, behind the big basket. His cords are going to be showing a bit, but we're going to try to hide them as much as possible. Because if you know me, you know I like neatness. Not really too much, but I like a little bit of neatness. And it's fine if I see a little bit of the cords, but I don't want to see, like, all of the cord. Just like that. Actually, maybe just like this. My mirror. Right there. Yas! Flip that. Actually, they look pretty aesthetically pleasing right here. So I'll leave that. Move this over. Or I can move this back over here. Put this book up here. Grab this baby. And this is probably what I'm actually going to do and hook this baby. Don't worry, I'm not abusing it. The big part of the cord keeps hitting my desk thing. Oh, oh be super duper careful. Now we're not going to connect it up because I don't know which looks more aesthetically pleasing. This or this. I feel like this. We're going to put this all the way back down there then. Put this with the other thing that I really don't want to break. Because these are my children. I use these too much to break. Cords are a big mess. I'm going to sort out the cords. Uh, looking nice. Ah, right here. All the way up there. Move over a little bit. Then let's pick up my favorite charm to go in here. We'll go away. Oops. All the pencils. Something fell? Nope, nothing fell. So let's see. This bell. This key. I want a really old charm. This is not too old. This is really old. I think this is pretty old. This for a fact is really old. I think these three are the last couple options. This one's pretty small. We'll do the piece because I like the symbol a little bit more than a butterfly. There's that. Okay, this box, we're gonna put some stuff in it, but first we have to put away more stuff that goes all the way up there that I forgot about. Such as. These photos. I have them everywhere, but these are these two are probably my favorite. We're gonna put them around my mom picture. 
or my mom when she was little, or camera. There you go. Box. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. I'm gonna put these fabrics in them. These fabrics in here. Stuff animals. Probably still use the penguin. And the black cat, because the black cat was my first one, and the penguin's been with me forever. But the rest of it, no. Let's see if these papers are even going to fit in here. I'll put as much papers in here that do fit in. Because these papers have been driving me crazy my whole entire life. This is going to stay out because it's just cool. And one more thing that I... Wanted to keep because I liked the company, but now I don't know how I feel about it, so I'll... I don't know. Papers. Thicker papers. Oh, and thinner papers, but mainly thicker papers. More thicker papers. More thin papers. That, that, this, no, <gasps> baby kitty, I wish I could set you up on my desk, <gasps> uh, cardboard, I was going to paint. Stapler stuff. This box is just this box. This box is just basically. I think I'll keep out the stapler. Okay, so the box is done. I think we're gonna put that in the top part. No. Let's put it on the bottom part. I wouldn't mean that black cat Binks, but he has white markings, and Binks doesn't have white markings, and he has purple eyes, and Binks has green eyes. That's why. <laughs> this Beanie Blue that's going to go on my desk is named Binks. He doesn't have pink ears, that pink. They're not glittery, but still. It's just so pretty and cute. I love it. And it represents Binks. That's all enough reasons for me to put him on my desk. These pounds are gonna go under my desk. All the way back there. Stapler. Hotel shelf. I don't think I've ever had a hotel shelf. The whole
on the shelf is about to be just like my drawing tablet and stuff. So. Oof. So, okay. The giant shelf is where all my cords are going to go. Basically. And my electronics. First drawing tablet. Computer. I think these are two separate cords that I'm going through right now, but no, nope, they're one. Wrong cord. I think this is my brother's. Yeah, it's my brother's. For his laptop. So we're gonna give it some hands. Be right back. Just look at nothing. I put that away. Now, how much I love this on my desk. It takes up way too much space. We're going to take this off of my desk. And we're going to put it under my desk. And of course, I'll leave it. Easy access, just in case I do you want to use the gun, then I can. The mic, carefully set to the side. Okay, so we're going to put it in here like that. We're gonna do it pretty neatly, but as neat as it can be. The mic, we're gonna put back on the fluffy thing, and we're gonna twist the cord around. So that's all in one piece, we don't get all the cords mixed up. My thing definitely looks more grown, less like a streamer. I'm not too good streamer, but more grown. Now, this is going to go in a totally different video because I have to explain everything that I use. So, I'm going to bring back up my chair. So I don't need to go all the way over here now. Put my headphones on my laptop. And I'm going to see you in the next video where I do my drawer.